Good morning, and welcome to the start of the 2020 theme park season. I am your host, Mike Melly One. Yeah, I surprised you, didn't I? You thought, oh, you're going to the World of Disney. I mean, the show's probably over. Already? Well, not really. We're going to start the year off a little bit differently. We're going to be heading to the monorail station to begin the 2020 season. Oh, on a, bit of a, a good note before we kick things off. Of course, we're going to get two last ri- my final two rides on the Snow White Scary Adventures as we know it, because I think my gut feeling is we're probably it's going to be toned. The scariness will be toned down a little bit. It's going to be, if I have to make a prediction, it's probably going to be similar to what Florida got before that closed because of the mine the mine car coaster. So yeah, we're here nice and early at close to 8.30 in the morning, yes, <laughs> because this is the first day that some of the regular APs are unblocked, but chances, I'm not sure how uh, busy the park's going to be today, of course we got, of course this is the last day for the, tomorrow's the last day for Snow White, Mark Twain and Small World and Indy before they go down for their respective refurbishment, with Mark Twain coming in. Coming back at the end of the month, which isn't too bad. Hopefully they can fix the win. Hopefully they can fix that window. Hopefully fix, fix the whistle on the march. We'll be getting on that today. Getting on that today. Of course, we're gonna take a daytime walk around Galaxy's Edge because we are less than three weeks away from the opening of Rise of the Resistance. Because already on YouTube, they're already advertising it. Already advertising it. Of course, since I'm here on a Sunday, which is pretty weird because my schedule changed. My schedule has changed. So, this should be an interesting day. And boy, it's worth seeing this during the day, I have to say. So, we got a lot of stuff planned today and tomorrow. We're going to try and get the Dapper Dams in today as well. The Dapper Dan's in today. Of course, we're going to check on the progress of Avengers Campus because Disney did announce that it'll open in summer 2020. No date yet. So we do have a bit of a time, so we know the time frame of when it's going to open. We don't know how things are going to go. <laughs> I'm sorry right now. It is kind of, it is absolutely freezing here today. Hopefully the weather is what's going to tell people to stay home. <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> and honestly, going into today, I thought security was going to get beep due to <clears throat> recent current events that I probably don't approve of, but nope, it's just standard security, so overall, not bad. So, and by the way, no, I don't have Disney Plus yet, so, alright, so we have a closer, of course we're going to try and get Black Tap and, uh, and uh, that salt place, that ice cream place where Hawking Docks used to be. We're going to try and get that in today as well. In today as well. Like I said, guys, we're in, you guys are in for a great show today. Great show in today. So hopefully today we'll get a lot of good rides in. A lot of good rides in today. All right. So... So we're going to be heading straight towards the monorail station, which, honestly, one of the only down notes of, down notes of uh, the possible, of the, with the hotel not being built right here, so I really wish the station would get a bit of an overhaul, because look, I think this station, the monorail station is starting to show its age. It's really starting to show its age. 
So, all right, guys, I'll see you guys when I get in. All right, it's going to be one monorail so far. <laughs> Shocker. Uh, monorail blue. Yeah. So it's going to be interesting to see how we get in. Of course, I have a feeling once, to, once the end is operating, when the, the park, when Disney, when Disneyland Park itself closes, end is operating day tomorrow. I think that's when. Speaking of tomorrow, man. <laughs> That's when I believe the work to be built that new entranceway will begin. Will begin. That's pretty much my best guess at this point. Here we go. Let's see. Unfortunately, one of us is going to have to be the odd winner. Unless we're the unwinners. Nope. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Let's make, let's try and make my move. Oh, no. Okay, let's try and make. I got the war. I took the worst possible seat, but that's all right. First run of the season. Only can go up from here. Mm -hmm. All right. Bye. Sorry. This one will be back in, in a half hour. There's the walkway, which I accidentally deleted. The last time I was here. Don't worry, we'll walk over that later tonight. And of course, Tuesday is when we're going to see the 2020 debut of the tram. And that's also probably when we're going to see the night ride for Smuggler's Run. For Hybrid Space Mountain. Some of the crews are pretty tired. So be sure to remain seated, keeping your hands and arms inside the cabin. Oh, wow. I don't even want to walk on for Autotopia. You know what? That's going to be our next ride. Autotopia. And then we'll often make our way to Snow White. Second to last ride on that, and the last daytime ride on it. And hopefully the last ride will be nighttime right after I finish Frozen. Yes, I'll be watching Frozen tonight. And I think the stuff will have to wait until Thursday. Thank goodness they have been there. Oh, they had a table. As we cruise over tomorrow, our pilot would like to share a few program reminders. Good morning, everybody. 
Magic happens from here, then you will, you bet your butt, I'll be trying to get a, every, get a lot of views on, of views on this parade. The this, 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 and now we're riding alongside the happiest kingdom of them all, Fantasyland. Home to Pinocchio, Snow White, and other storybook characters. Twenty. Yeah. You guys are first ride proper inside the park. Autotopia coming up next. 